Hello everyone. In this lesson, we are going to learn about contractions. Contraction means to make something shorter. So in the English language, contractions are used when we want to shorten sentences. For example, if I said, I am a girl, which I am, of course, and if I used a contraction in this sentence, I would combine I and am to make I'm. I'm a girl. Let us try another sentence. She will be coming over to my house tomorrow. Contraction can be made from the words she and will. She'll be coming over to my house tomorrow. Simple contractions are made by combining nouns and pronouns with auxiliary verbs. Now you already know what nouns are. Pronouns are words that replace nouns such as I, you, she, he, they, we, and it. There are many auxiliary verbs, but in this lesson, we will learn contractions using only a few auxiliary verbs. Now let's start making sentences with contractions. Look at this sentence. My father is coming with us. If we shorten father and is, we get fathers with an apostrophe. My father's coming with us. Here's a sentence using the word has. Serena has scored a hundred marks in her history test. Here again, when we combine Serena and has, we get Serena's with an apostrophe. Serena's scored a hundred marks in her history test. Now let's look at contractions made from these verbs does, do and did. Kavita does not want to join us for the game. A contraction of does and not will give us doesn't. Kavita doesn't want to join us for the game. Next, the students of Form 3A do not have English textbooks. Do and not becomes don't. The students of Form 3A don't have English textbooks. Let's make a sentence with did. James did not wash the floor last night. Did not becomes didn't. James didn't wash the floor last night. Now let's look at contractions with the verbs can, could and will. Sorry, I cannot come to your house tomorrow. The contraction for can and not is can't. Sorry, I can't come to your house tomorrow. Zul could not play for the school soccer team because he was injured. When we combine could and not, we get couldn't. Zul couldn't play for the school soccer team because he was injured. Mary says she will not donate to the charity fund. The contraction for will and not is won't. Mary says she won't donate to the charity fund. Now that we have learned contractions, let's look at these sentences and replace them with the words in bold with contractions. Number one, we will be having a big birthday party for my mom next Saturday. If we combine we and will, we should get will. We'll be having a big birthday party for my mom next Saturday. Number two, Mazira does not like eating vegetables. The contraction of does and not is doesn't. Mazira doesn't like eating vegetables. Number three, they are going to watch the concert on Sunday. To combine they and are, we have to drop the er uh from are and we get there. They're going to watch the concert on Sunday. Number four, you have not finished your homework. The contraction of you and have is you've. You've not finished your homework. Number five, Raj is coming to my house this evening. Raj without an apostrophe or Raj with an apostrophe. Putting Raj and is together, we get Raj, but it must be Raj with an apostrophe. 
Raj is coming to my house this evening. Number six. It is now a week that my cat has been ill. It's with an apostrophe or it's without an apostrophe. When we combine it and is, we get it's. But we have it's with an apostrophe and it's without an apostrophe. Now the correct answer would be it's with an apostrophe. It's now a week that my cat has been ill. And that's it for this lesson. Goodbye.